Okay, so um, I was playing the other day and I um, saw that I had purchased, eh, well, I don't know how long ago, um, a thing called Alcohol Lift. And uh, I thought, why did I buy that? And I went, What's it for? And <laughs> yeah, so I tried to play with it a bit and then thought, oh, this is just dumb. Uh, and I put it away again. <laughs> Anybody else do that? No, just me, right? Um, and I suddenly thought, you know, alcohol lift. You know, I'm playing all the time or often with with a with things that I have printed out on my jet uh, inkjet printer. Now I have, I feel I have a good one, the Epson. The ink is, is, you know, pretty, um, you know, it, it, it doesn't smudge as easily as some printers. But um, it's not perfect, not by a long shot. And, you know, you always have to worry about that. So when you're, when you're doing collage, if you're printing things out, then you have to think about putting them down and carefully uh, painting over them with matte medium so that they don't smudge when you put the next layer down. And then I thought, you know, I'd, I'd seen a couple of happy accidents where I hadn't gotten the, uh, where the paper hadn't been sealed properly and the next layer made some interesting effects on the paper. And I thought, why am I not just trying to see where I can go with that um, in terms of lifting ink off of um, inkjet printer pages. Am I being clear? This page is printed. This is a background by Peg Robinson. Uh, and it's been printed on my inkjet printer. And that, that color is never uh, color fast, totally color fast. And I am going to use water to lift it off on purpose so here we go i'm going to take a stamp see that's a uh, it's hard to see there but it's a poppy and uh, i am going to um actually i'm not going to use that one i'm going to use one of these that for some reason i have lost my my uh block you know the uh, acrylic blocks you buy for stamping I have no idea what I've done with mine and I, I'm not going to waste my energy looking so I'm going to uh, I'm going to spray this this is a Donnie down Donna Downison no Dina Wakely yeah one of those big names and I'm going to spray it I have a bottle of water here. I'm going to spray it with water. I'm going to do it away from the camera because it's, you, you need to put a considerable amount of water on it. And I should not be doing this without a plastic glove on, but I'm going to do it anyway. So I give it a good spray and then shake off the absolute excess. You'll see it's sopping. And then I'm going to put it down on the paper and leave it for a minute let the water that's there soak in and then we'll just see what we get it's my luck we won't have anything <laughs> and then then you won't ever see it because, you know, if it's that bad. So dark colors, I find, uh, you know, they uh, are less uh, uh, straight. Uh, they are less. Uh... Yeah. OK, so that's not great. OK, so I'm going to try again. Now this time I'm not gonna 
I'm going to put it on there really quickly. Lots and lots of water. So what would be the point of doing this, you ask yourself? <laughs> Why is this woman crazy? She's going to ruin her background. She's going to, you know, that nice, um, I think it's alcohol inks that Peg is. Uh, and there we are. I think it's starting to go there. Okay. So here is what I think. Now you have a ghost. You see that? You have a ghost of that bird. And you can go back in and, you know, recreate the bird with a pen or a, and I can't do anything till it's dry. So uh, we're going to dry it. And uh, in the meantime, I'm going to try uh, another bird. Oops, you see? No, uh, see, now there's a problem because I don't have my. See, I dropped water. But you see, this one came out a little clearer. See that? I don't know if you can see that. Can you? If I turn them this way, is that easier to see? See that? That might be fun. This side might be fun. Look at that. That's quite, that's quite nice, I think. Don't you? And I'm going to try and do it with, uh, this is a, a background by um, APG Jamie, and, and she says that it's done by, with, uh, mm, Distress Inks, yeah, and uh, you can kind of see that, but it, it uh, Distress Inks, I'm going to try the the uh, poppy and see how if we can get those lighter colors to lift as well. Drip drip which is Yeah, you have to leave it my experience tells me that you have to leave it some time because it it will uh... okay so that's uh so again you're saying to yourself that's look at that how nice that is the back So you're saying to yourself, why is she doing that? And, uh, and, and stuff. And so that's going to bug some people, um, but not me. Uh, so I am going to just go over this with a white pen. I can see the bird. And when I can't see the bird, I'm going to look back at the stamp right and where did that stamp go of course I lost it just because I want to look at it oh here it is
Now, interesting. Uh, you know, I think it has possibilities. I mean, you know, everybody's going to be different about these things, but... And, you know, um, so I'm looking at this and saying, well, obviously I'm going to have a different, slightly different bird than the one that would have been stamped on there, right? Very, um, what shall we say? Loosey goosey. You know, it may not be everybody's cup of tea. Now, this one I wouldn't do with this one. You know, one of the things that might be fun to do is um, just do drops. Uh, and then, uh, let's see what we got here. And doodle, uh, doodly, 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 do. I do not doodle much. You could actually, if you're uh, you know, the very precise kind of person. Uh, you could actually stamp over this. Anyway, I don't think that's any great piece of art, but I do like the fact that you can, that you can make, that you could have that echo of the image around it. And this, and as you can see, I think the dark works better. You could actually doodle around all those little spots. Anyway, you're uh, just a thought. Something that is fun. Instead of trying always to, um, you know, fight against the, the, the thing that's happening naturally, then maybe uh, we go with it. Let's see what we can do with its natural properties. What do you say? Okay. Well, that's it for me. Uh, hope you enjoyed this. And if I can get this thing to work, I'll say bye for now.